aso uh, kungunda nigo omwasiri bobo sombe davis chirichin nigo nyara kawe kabosyo uwe bunge ye senate likwerra ali amanyete igoro yengana e yare te libera no bototukanu ansense ya kenya igoro ye tigye chinda ya choma kenya international airport asanyara ga kwegerra igoro yengane yo nande onyara wa kweresa igoro yengane yo oti ya senate inda ba kenya bonsi banyarwa kumanya lingane fully walk this journey uh, with the concession era, we will see a concession document being signed on step six, 17. That is, uh, Chairman, the process under the PPP Act uh, and an unsolicited uh, public investment proposal is a procurement process under the PPP Act. I think because this Act, Chair, and I did say this, gives us a great opportunity to talk to Kenya through Parliament uh, to really appreciate the fact that when we don't have much fiscal space for the mega projects like Rironi Mau Summit, Eldoret, Malaba Road, or the expressway, uh, or the, the new airport, the way to go is to bring the private sector to build. And the next step I'll be, and maybe to just finalize before I go to question and answer, when, when this process is employed, honorable members, we seek to ensure that the return on equity to the investor is not unreasonable. Those are the things you negotiate through this process. Are they seeking too much profit on their investment? Uh, are they investing too much equity? Equity, you know, is expensive. Uh, if I can take, I'd rather take my money to the bank and earn 18 percent today instead of being forced to invest. Uh, in our, with country risk at 12%, 14%, uh, 